Whoa! Hey, there you are. What's cracking? So, we all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did it. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file. What is wrong with you? Davey! Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked! Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. It's gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Huh? Really? The criminals are believed to escape with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey. engagement rings. Albert's story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, Hey, you gotta move these bikes. I don't know anything about that. And this other guy runs out of the shop, pushes me over, and says something like, You forget thousands of things every day. You'll make sure this is one of them. That was pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor, I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Well, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? Is that the problem here? Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, huh? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh, I don't hey. mean nothing by it, man. So I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug, yeah. yeah. Shh. <laughs> fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you, then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> fuck! Now, we got to speak to Johnny's recently bereaved brothers. Wait! This ghost I saw. His name is Michael Townley. Sounds like he's living in Los Santos. Find him. Really? Uh, my cousin's there, but I don't... Find him, Wade! Does this mean I don't have to come see the bikers? We're in a hurry, but not that much of a hurry. But if we bury Johnny in the desert, and then quiet down that bitch Ashley you was in, then they don't need to find out about it. You think it's clever to disrespect women? Disrespect? What? I, I wasn't disrespecting. I was just saying we should kill her. You called her a bitch. Ain't you got a mother? Everyone got mothers, at least one. The bikers are meant to be over by the farm on the right. Oh! No! Hey, you seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. 
Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did, just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you messing with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry, what was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient part of you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Well, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. If that van takes us back to the camp, this area ain't gonna have a biker problem much longer. You got him! Who makes the set? I work. Yeah, you didn't see that coming. Okay, now we follow the van back. Did you see the look on their faces? We scared them, didn't we? Yeah, thank fuck they didn't make you for the harmless idiots you are! You need some seat belts back here, or straps, or something! I only keep things in the back I don't mind losing. Oh. Sharp left! Slow it down! Uh, I can't see us taking out all the bikers' disco, boss! I mean, there'll be some by that airstrip, and some over, you know, by that- If not today, their time will soon be upon them. I'm sure there's a reason you're giving them all the space. You're trying my patience. Whoa. You keep left. We might be able to jump across there. Make sure. Once you know, you can drop me and Wade at the trailer. Maybe bring Chef to finish that. We do this now, Ron, all of us. Okay. We're right on these bricks. Ah. Where are we going? Come on. Oh, okay. I'll make my own lost MC colors out of this prick's leather. I gotta take third by your blood! Ah! Oh, look, look! They're pulling up! You did it, Trevor! They're stopping! Hold the perimeter, fuckwits. Daddy's going to work. Penis bigger! Kill you! Fuck! He killed you! Don't worry! It's 
Plenty of me to go around. On our bikes, are we? This is hard for me, too. I've had to kill half the tweakers in the county. Get you to anything? Soda? Snacks? No! Get in the fucking truck! <sighs> Wade? What are you still doing here? You said. I said go find a fucking ghost in Los Santos, alright? You looking for motivation? Oh, uh, yeah, pick me up some sticky bombs! Ortega lives near here. Let's go see him. It's one thing messing with tweaked out bikers, but the Aztecas? Man! The Aztecas? It's just a name. Is he Illuminati as well? And a wacky? Huh? One of those lizard people? I got this Chinese contact you can meet at the end. He'll buy all the meth we can cook. Here he is. Let's wake him up. What? With the truck? No, come on. Ortega runs the whole county. Soggy friend, you are out of business. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. Saying something don't make it true. Trevor! You're out of business, my friend. I always let you operate. Oh, that feels better! I guess he don't run nothing no more. We can go now, right? <laughs> this is an unprecedented turn of events. I always said I was gonna take over. <laughs> People say all kinds of stuff when they're three days into a smoking party. You calling me a bullshitter, friend? Clearly not. No way! You're a man of your word, as evidenced by said events. If I say something is going to happen, it's going to. Maybe not today or tomorrow, but as soon as the moment is opportune. Understood. Yes, sir. If I say I'm fucking dead, then fucking dead I am! I'm not gonna raise my balding head on a beach in ten years' time saying, All is well! Is this about the ghost? Michael fucking Townley, yes it is! Who well, you told me about him, your old running buddy. And who is the other one? Brad. Brad is the other one. He's locked up in a federal penitentiary. When he finds out Michael survived that job. Yeah. 
What do you think happened? If I knew what happened, I wouldn't be bemoaning these last ten years I've spent in ignorance. Some say ignorance is bliss. For a man with an interest, some may say obsession. Get out of the car, Ron. I need time to think. Run! Speak! You know I don't like using these things. They're listening. Then make it quick. That business thing's been set up. The Chinese guy, Mr. Chang, is at the inn. You said that on the phone? What the fuck is wrong with you, damn it, Ron? Now I'm gonna have to discipline you and you know how I feel about that. Trevor, you're still banned. What about these two? Whoever wins gets banned. <laughs> He's one, ban him. I can't ban him. He's my goddamn husband. He's young enough to be your son. Ain't the internet a beautiful thing, honey? Anyway, I mm. saved your husband. Now get me a drink. I got a meeting. Okay, but any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. <laughs> You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Mr. Tao Chung is uh, pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. I'm out. No, don't go! Please! I beg you, if you go, his father kill me. Why do I give a fuck? You don't, but we hear that Trevor Phillips Corporation is serious business. We pay good price. Things work out, we partner, make big money. <laughs> I'm rushing! Well, let me show you the operation. This is us. We're just coming down to see the kitchen. 
You can't get here quick enough! The Aztecas are coming! They think you took out Ortega! They ain't mistaken! Well, get down here and take them out, too! You sure your boss don't want this crank for his own personal consumption? No, no. Mr. Cheng Sr. is very specific. He wants a good, reliable source of methamphetamine. We will buy from you here and distribute using established networks. Trevor, we ain't got long. Whoa, 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 whoa. manner, chef. These are our guests, all right? We got Mr. <laughs> Cheng and his humble servant. Hey, Lo Shung. Uh, <laughs> nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right? Gentlemen, please, come check out the storage facilities. Go on now. Nice, right? Oh, there whoa. you go. <laughs> Apple room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out! No. So bomb. The tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. Should we get the guns? Yes, Chef. Help me! If I knew we were having visitors, I would have done a little spring clean. They really want you dead. They might be catching a chill. Yeah, all right, time to recommence the tour, gentlemen. 
I think we have seen quite enough. Guy Zhong. But we haven't come to eat. I'll swing by and sign the contracts, all right? Just ignore the bodies. Hey, Trevor. Are we still going to cook that batch? Fuck yeah! They were here for you. Here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K. And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. Look at this. This. This, 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 this statue here of impotent rage. This fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic midlife crisis, hog riding, shaven headed. Fruity leather, chapped wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor. They are. They're chapped wearing assholes. Oh, wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, <laughs> Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find him. Los Santos is a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there or anyone matching his description, I'm gonna kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you, Wayne. Now smile. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. all right? That's better. Run along. Uh. <laughs> now, Ron, shall we go? I cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of impotent rage. The cheek, huh? The fucking cheek of it. I gotta make a stop at ammunition. You're meeting me at the Lost MC's airfield. Come in! Come in! I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh, what are you buying at the gun shop? I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high power scope. Melvin! How do you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP industry. That sniper on your wall looks like it'll do the job. That's the chestnut. You got a scope and a suppressor for this? It'll be quiet as a mouse. Get that look off your face. I know you sold Cletus's gun and he ain't got three brain cells. Meet me at the water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them. I'm up here. I don't see the hardware. But I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. Hardware's not here yet. I'm coming up. Go on up, boss. This is high enough for me. Enough waiting. This is your moment, Ronald. Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I'm watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now, relax. 
The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Over by the road! You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! Well, get a move on! I'm moving! Just keep me covered, okay? They got a guard at the bottom of those steps! Under the control tower? Good kill, Trevor! Come on! Keep it moving! You hear that? I can hear an engine! They'll see that body! You can relax, because lights are out already! If the man wants to pay his respect... You should have seen the look on his face! There's a guy coming out of... So long, sailor! Oh no! Bottom of the tower! Another guy's on his way! He's down there, amongst the bodies! Clean shot, Trev! Woo! Down he goes! Can you get your sights back on me? Come on, man! You're in my crosshairs again! And there's no one left to kill, so get over to that gas tank and plant the bomb! I'm on it, but there's a guy coming out of that building, I think. I can hear him. There's another guy! Coming out of the building! Good kill, Trevor! I'm a-fixing it! Don't let him sneak up on me, okay? And watch out for the tank. It'll go up if you hit it. I think someone's coming. Shit. He knows I'm here. A bolt from the blue. Can you hear that? Chopper, incoming. Always hate it.
Cousins, where the lost were likely to be sending them. Or? Or other neighbors, those in the south, our Mexican brethren. I assume you got all kinds of connections in Canada. Why would you make an assumption like that? It's obvious. Why is it obvious? Spell it out for me before I order you to fly that plane into a mountain. to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. You wouldn't really do that to me, would you? Beat me and you'll see. Uh, I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. I can just about get where I'm going, but I don't got much choice over whether it's fast or slow. Then get better at it, or fly through a barn. Would a barn slow me down? It might do, or it might kill you instead. I'm just gonna fly normal, and I'll rely on you getting there quicker. You're braver than I thought. Stay low over those wetlands, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? Mexico, yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay?
think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue? That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might. Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise. Hmm? Managerial innovations. Unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to meditate. Or masturbate. Or both. You sure as shit are one dumb, ignorant, white trash hillbilly, Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right! <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Quite <laughs> Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I've proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you, and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? I'm not at liberty to say. Oh, no, no, no. You're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. <laughs> who? Fucking who? 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 The O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. Because those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem, since one of them's going to have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other. Fuck you guys and fuck them. <laughs> hold on,
Phillips! Elwood O'Neill! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Trevor, it's business! That wide-eyed idiot was mine! It's business, fella! You wanna discuss it? We're at the farm. Ernie, Earl, Walton, Wynn, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dan, all of us. Start writing those names on tombstones, cause I'm on the way to your lab and we're gonna see how much of a family meth business you got when I'm done! Mm. All of you are going to die! to call my own on this godforsaken earth! Assholes! I just spoke to that maniac, Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. Right. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse. Time! Competition in the marketplace! Operation to me. You are a piece of shit. Keep him out of the lab. Fuck not. How about a merger, you yourself. pricks? Yeah, fuck yeah. you, dealer man. He's inside. Look out. Shit. Get man. that motherfucker out the house. Oh, Holy fuck. Take over time. You get out this property! Larry's been hit! Get your own fucking business! Hey, fuck you! Go home! Come on, man! Fuck Trevor Phillips, man! Fuck him! Shit! He's coming his way! Ah! 
Back, you motherfucker! You gonna be bit. Keep him upstairs! Oh, shit! He's down here! Gas in a meth lab! Oh, you're gonna burn, you idiots! Mmm, you smell that? Everything you've built, see how it feels! Come on, come on! Smell those fumes! Yeah, you've only yourselves to blame. Burn, you disrespectful pricks! Get back here! You're not even hidden! Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor! I've been trying! Come on over here, alright? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying! I know, I know. I thought you said you were not gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley! There's... Two Michael Townleys living in L.S. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut then up I before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta. About the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda. Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo. Uh, uh, don't you ever not tell me things I want to know. Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard. Get out here. We're going to Los Santos. Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money and tidy my shit up. Let's go, wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? Um, <laughs> so, so, so we're headed to Los Santos then? Soon, I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's the stop? Ice cream? Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He's bunked in with his girlfriend someplace called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's the stop? Family's important, Wade. Not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, um... 
Uh, that might be nice, but where are we stopping on the way? Because, you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sakes! Another chapter of the lost have descended on this fine town, looking to mourn and maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Camps up here. I'll wait till dark before I drop in again. The assholes here. They slipped. Ice took a hold of this whole place. You're lost, but you are not forgotten, brothers. We'll find that motherfucker. I got you them bombs and that pistol with the thing that makes it quiet on it. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts for these pricks. There you go. Johnny K wasn't fit for the Lost MC. Billy Gray, man, he was a Lost MC chapter friend. Something older they could be proud of. Whatever they said about him snitching, man, that was bullshit. Billy would have never let this shit go down right here. One creepy little dealer taking down a whole chapter. Ridiculous. Let's take a ride. See what kind of shape they left this place in. That's the spot. You finish your business, Trevor? Not quite. We're just, uh, taking a break. Nothing like some fireworks at a party. Clean you like motherfucker. What you mean? That let some pussy walking here do him like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fucking crack out their brain. But, but like a little bit of crack is just like okay, right? So, right? Like, a, like a taste from time to time? Yeah, man. Taste is cool. Everything in moderation. Good, good, you know, because I was just like starting to worry, you know. Just get your tweak of mind around that end. Okay. 
Let's give your friends the send-off they deserve. Here we come. That go okay? I heard lots of banging and screaming, but then not, not the nice kind. Yeah, it went good, Wade. We don't have to think about the loss no more. Let's go find my old buddy. This Michael Townley guy must have pissed you off real bad for you to want to find him so much. He didn't piss me off. The guys that killed him? The federal government. They pissed me off. But... If he's dead, who's this? Now you're starting to grasp the pertinent questions. Who is this guy using my dead friend's tired-ass movie quotes? With my dead friend's alias? And my dead friend's family? In a house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions? Wow, that's a real mindfuck. Yeah, I'll show you a fucking mindfuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye. It's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean anything by that, T. Trevor? Lube up your eye hole, fucker! Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I am about ready to turn you into roadkill! Uh, please! Don't turn me into anything! I just wanna be away. Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade! Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all! Can you tell me a story? No, Wade! Let's play a game then! You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first. I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? Ooh, damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, 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 how about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tr... Tr... Uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Sounds weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent, charisma, and guile that a boy could have. Right there, Los Santos. The end of the fucking earth. This is the place. I seen it on the holiday card. So, this is Rose Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert. It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. This is where dead men come back to life, huh? It's been nearly ten years. Oh, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You mother fucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! I thought we were going to my cousin. Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? It's this Fuji Beach where he's staying. Will you tell me the story about that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? Right, 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 right. So, this kid, he could fly planes. So, he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe, just maybe, drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable and grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him into a deep pit of doubt despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. 
That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. Nish Michelle. A lady troll? Yeah, he had tits like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people, and little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. And they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits. Even bigger than his real troll tits. Oh, oh, we're near Floyd Caps. I've seen it on iPhone maps. I'll give you directions. It's a rat up here. You don't turn here. This is the place, I think it is at least. Cousin Floyd! Come up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Wade! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you, Wade! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here. He's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. You can't smoke here. Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was called in Evelyn's bed. A guy was never proved. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend, she'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah, okay. Wait, uh, I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go, too. All right, okay. okay. Fuck. 